Yeah, it's a special night. Yeah, I feel like you've definitely made an impression. I feel good. like you're the one guy out of all the guys. Oh my god. Oh really? Yeah. You know, <laughs> That's like, good to know. We're just like throwing bows. Like who's? Um, hey guys, and welcome back to Little Black Fucking Know What Time It Is. Yeah. Talking to you guys about Love Island. Talking to you about Mackenzie. Oh baby. Connor and the Jay Lane situation, baby. All right, listen. <laughs> you already know what to do, baby. If you're oh, well. If you're new to the channel, then you don't know what to do, innit? You gotta like, share, subscribe. And for those of you who are returnees, baby, you know what to do? Uh, get it. You got the minerals, you got the minerals. Alright then, send them back to the manufacturer, get your merchandise. Alright, cool. Let's get into the let's get into the, to the review. Alright, Love Island USA thing. It's smart, it's smart, it's really, really smart. Okay, why is it mad? It's mad because with Mackenzie and also um, Connor, I, bear in mind I haven't watched this show past this, it's the first episode I've watched. Um, obviously, something got said to both of them. They said something, yeah? And I don't, I, I feel like Mackenzie took advantage of whatever they said, yeah? Because she's deciding to really go out there and date, okay? Now, my issue with the fact that she's going out to date isn't the fact she's going out to date. It's the fact that she said a mixed signal, you understand? mixed signal do you know what i mean because she put packed a bear in the bag it's not say hi to connor for me okay take good care of him and scare off all the ladies i had a just and an, it's not just any bear you know it's not any teddy bear okay it i don't know what his name what's his name greg whatever his name is lacy lucy whatever his name is yeah she's given that bear a name okay so it's taken on human form okay it's got some type of sentimental value to her some type of emotional value to her for her to pack the bear in the back where can i go oh, oh it's gus yeah i got gus oh, oh my gosh smells like her too it means brother on the other side i care about you don't mess around, yeah? If I'm a if I'm a person on the other end, I'm taking it that, oh, she really cares because she sent her bear across. You're not just sending over your things. You sent over a bear across. You could have sent your panties. You could have sent anything else which doesn't hold emotional value. The teddy bear holds some type of emotional value. And so when you send that across, you're sending an emotional message to me, which is why I believe Connor decided at that point that listen, I'm gonna mess around a little bit, and when I say mess around a little bit, I'm just gonna do a little dingly dangly and nothing else, right? So I don't, but I don't know if he kissed someone. I can't remember if he actually kissed somebody, right? Um, but what I do know is that obviously, you know, he did. Yeah, he did. He lipsed up Mercedes' ear, and obviously, listen, I'm gonna say it again. I don't understand these things, bro. Like, what's too far? What what's what's too far? If you're in a relationship, yeah, okay. I don't care if it's a dare or not, blood. No one's lips in anybody's ear, blood. Black game. You understand? Yeah? We're already on a bad foot, cuz. You understand? This, yeah, didn't need to happen. Yeah? You could have told the truth. But you chose a dare. No one the dare could potentially take you to. Could, no one the potential of the dare could take you to dare to do something stupid. Yeah? You knew that. Alright, cool. Back to Mackenzie. Here's the thing with Mackenzie. Mackenzie eh, chased after Jaylee. No, no, listen, the guy didn't chase her. She chased him. And that's the maddest difference. Um, because I think for Connor, him lips and Mercedes ear is more about showing the boys that, listen, who can get the girl that everybody wanted, right? Okay, not to excuse his behavior, by the way. <laughs> no, no, no. Um, but what we saw with Mackenzie was that earlier on, Jalene said, first, the first thing that Jalene, 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 Jalene said when he got there, yeah, is that he likes Moira. You know what I'm saying? He likes Moira. Love your personality. Like, your eyes are incredible. Um, but I think it was your smile that got me. It's just mm -hmm. like, oh, she's like incredibly beautiful, but like I everything. Like Moira. You understand? He said, he, he said, listen, you caught my eye, Moira. First thing is, he initiated that straight away, all right? He stood in position. Secondly, he went to talk to her, called her beautiful, said she, he found her attractive, said that she's like this, says like that, right? He wants to get to know her, you understand, right? Cool. By the end of the night, we're seeing now Mackenzie in a red dress, you understand? Devil in a red dress, da 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 da. It's not me a blue, but anyway. Um, and she goes and sits down with Jalen. 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 It's Jalen. <sighs> Go sit down with Jalen. Um, and it's really interesting because. If you see her body language in comparison to what we saw with Sally and Aaron, completely different. 
She just Yeah, it's a special night. Yeah, I feel like you've definitely made an impression. I feel like good. you're the one guy out of all the guys. Oh my god. Oh really? Yeah, you're <laughs> oh, that's like, good to know. We're just like throwing bows, like who's um, <laughs> lean back. She's not you know what I'm saying? She's she's got a leg in an awkward position, I'm getting twisted. But she's quite comfortable, right? And the reason why, because she's on the attack. Like she's not she's not on defense. She's not being approached. She's approaching. Okay? And a tiger doesn't show you know the defensive mode when he's on attack he shows you how he's ready to go you understand so now she's having a conversation with him what's interesting is the language okay i always talk about the language so you know uh she says oh it's a special night yeah, i feel like you've definitely made an impression i feel like Good. you're the one guy out of all the guys oh my god obviously like he's one of the guys out of everyone who made an impression i want you to understand something the moment she says, you are one of the guys out of everybody that made an impression. You're the only guy that made an impression. You understand? Yeah? When you make it like that, you're basically saying, no one else really touched me like that. You understand what you did? Now, what does that do to a brother's head? That makes him feel like, okay, cool. What you're actually really saying to me is that you ain't got your eye on nobody. And I've managed to move you. You understand? I've managed to move you. Do you get what I'm saying? So, now you've put your egg in a basket straight away. Because you're saying that, listen, you're moved by him all right cool and then um you know um and what was interesting was the way that he laughed in response the way he you're the one guy out of all the guys oh my god oh really yeah you're <laughs> oh, that's like, good to know when he laughed it sounded like he was shocked at the fact that she mentioned that and i think he was shocked and the reason why i think he was shocked because i think he was talking to moira moira yeah and he had no intention of talking to mckenzie you know what i'm saying but Again, when people want to stay in the villa to earn the money and to get their reputation on the line and to get a social media profile increase, you'll do what you need to do. Do you understand? But his eye was never on Mackenzie. It was on Moira. You understand? So I think he was shocked when Mackenzie approached the way she did. But he gave a nice compliment when, compliment when he got there first. You're looking, looking nice. You're looking, you know, pretty. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, he never really said that he was attracted to her. He just said, he, you know, you're looking nice. Looking pretty. You know what I mean? That's the difference. I'm saying you look nice, you look good, it's different from I find you attractive. Do you understand? I think we can all appreciate someone looks good. I think we can all appreciate someone looks nice. I think we can all appreciate someone looks a certain way. But to say that the person is, um, to say that a person is making you feel a certain way is, is different. Do you know what I mean? Um, so yeah, for me that was a big thing, indication that maybe he doesn't feel her, he's not feeling her, but she's feeling him. Okay, cool. And then he threw out a baited question. I think, again, I tell you guys about bait questions. We do this to reel you in. No one really strikes my fancy off the bat. Me included? No, I think oh. I like you. Gotcha, yeah. gotcha. Okay, we need to find out where you are. Battle stations. We need to find out are you B7, E7, uh, F7. Where are you so I can send a missile to you, right? Now, he asked the question, said, um, when she was talking about how, who made made an impression or whatever he asks about whether no, um nobody got your eye even me and she said no oh, no no obviously you got my eye once she said that battle station log we know you're at b7 send the missiles away jalen now knows okay J jalen now knows okay where you stand and from that point onwards he makes a choice i can go with you whenever i want to no one really strikes my fancy off the bat me included no, I think oh. I like you. Gotcha, yeah. gotcha. Why? Because I can still keep my options open. You told me you like me now. I don't have to work for that. Do you understand? I don't have to work for that. I can I can have a conversation with you and then when I decide to, I'll just I'll choose it. I need to see what avenue is gonna work. If Moira's if Moira's not gonna work, you're gonna be the avenue I'm gonna choose. And uh you know, uh, and when she obviously obviously you, she fell into the trap. She fell into the trap, fell into the trap. Um and then it wasn't it wasn't it wasn't just she it wasn't just him. Because she actually lips like she proper, and I mean deeply, and I mean she did it for a longest time. There you go. Ah, yeah. Do it. Go. Ah, yeah. Yeah. Where she lips one brother. I don't even know his name. Okay, I'm not sure who it was. Okay, but the, the brother who she kissed, she was lipsing like there's no tomorrow. Like Connor don't even exist, blood. Why does it Connor's always get boiled off? Listen, don't leave me, don't leave me any of your children, Connor. Any Connor gets is always getting bullied. You know what I'm saying? Except Connor McGregor, but even then he met Khabib. So, like, I saw that and I said, I said, this girl, Connor is done. Connor is done. So you sent this bear ahead of time for what? Why did you send the bear? 
Do you understand? Like, so deep it, you were never really going to be focused on that. Do you know what I mean? You said you sent a bear because you you said you had a feeling that Casimir would come. So do you feel like he was going to choose another girl? Maybe that presents an insecurity in her if she thought he was going to choose another girl and she was going to choose someone else. Or maybe she felt like she was always going to choose someone else, which means she was never really down for Connor like that. Um, <clears throat> and obviously, the reasoning for that she said was that, you know, he wants to enjoy the process or whatever, enjoy the, 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 the stay or whatever. So she's also enjoying the stay. But darling, enjoy the stay does not mean go and live somebody. Have fun tonight. Doesn't mean for your girl to go out and start being a mad one. You understand? A girl said to me, go and have fun tonight. It does not mean go out there and go and do the mad thing. So don't come and use an excuse about fun in the process. You understand? Don't come and use that excuse. You know what I mean? Yeah? Alright, guys. That's me. Done. If you like what I do, comment down below. Let us know before. Make sure you share this. Make sure you like it. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. We appreciate you. Whoa, whoa.